thing I did is I used some of my homemade moisturizer. It's got coconut oil, olive oil, and beeswax, and uh, distillate that I made myself. So, yeah, I make my own beauty products. And this stuff is awesome for my skin. Um, the other thing I did was prep my lips, moisturize my lips with some of my, again, homemade lip balm. You like it? Yeah, it's really good. Yeah. I'll, uh, I have some extra at home, so at some point I'll give you one. That's Sebastian, by the way. He's my cosplay son. He just came down for my birthday. Alright, so the first thing I'm going to take, and this is a really weird, really weird product, but it works, um, again, spend the money for a good primer, but this was a cheap alternative that I wanted to try out, which is called the Lanacane Anti-Chafing Gel. The ingredients are exactly the same as like this, well not exactly, like one or two difference from the Smashbox primer. So it comes out as a gel and you just put it on and it like it dries on like super smooth. You don't have to use a lot at all. Don't use it on your eyes. I've heard people say that it worked great everywhere else, but that on the eyes then what happened is that um, it would make your eyeshadow slip. So, so I've got it all on. Alright, so the next thing I'm going to put on is my Smashbox 24 hour photo finish. And you'll need a tiny, tiny bit. I'm using the Kat Von D locket tattoo and a beauty blender. All right, so now we're going to start. So one of the things that I should probably show you guys is this is like my brush kit. And this is Sebi behind me. Say hi Sebi. <laughs> and this is why we shoot next to the door. So anyway, this is my 27 kit plus extra brushes. Um, that I got off eBay. It's not too bad. I have some kabuki brushes um, on the way. So now that we have that on, I'm gonna put a little bit of the Glamouflage hard candy, hard candy and medium. So just put it here. Now I have hyperpigmentation which means that like I have darkening of skin you can kind of see here I have my foundation on and even with that one you can still see it here a little bit here as well and then I usually do under my eye so I'm just gonna use my beauty blender here you can see it comes on really light to a degree that like I don't even need to use a brightener on this So you can see, again, once I powder, this is going to look a lot better, too. And I'm pressing here, and the only reason why, like, most people wouldn't is because that's a problem area for me. It's like really dark here and it's like especially when photos are taken I'm really self-conscious about that area normally I do it here too but because I'm gonna be bronzing it's not as much of an issue I might do a tiny tiny bit just because I don't 
that's something also that I'm very self-conscious about with my hyperpigmentation is the fact that um, a lot of people thought I was using bronzer the wrong way. They didn't know that that was actually just discoloration. Okay, so now I'm going to powder with the Bed Nye Neutral Set. Just put a little bit in the cap. I'm going to go ahead with the Hard Candy in Tropics. Wow. This is like super pigmented. This is, I just purchased this. So this is my first time actually using it. All right, so next we have Hard Candy Blush in <coughs> Living Doll. I wanted to buy like a really nice contour, but unfortunately I couldn't find the one that I was looking for, which was Tiki uh, in Hard Candy. Now I purchased this, which is the uh, Hard Candy Blush in Honeymoon, and this stuff is so light, like this is how light it is when it swatches. So this is actually like perfect as a highlight. For eye makeup, I'm not going to go very complicated right now. I have my 88 shade palette from BH Cosmetics. I'm actually waiting for a pile of um, Makeup Revolution palettes. So actually once I get those, I'm going to give this palette to my friend's daughter because it is nicely shaded. I just don't really have a need for it right now. So I'm gonna take just basic eyeshadow brush. Um, I'm not sure what colors to go for with this. What do you think? What colors should I go for? Hmm? What colors should I go for? Where? My eyes. eyes? So I'm gonna do red lips, so I don't want anything too crazy. Do like a dark like a smoky eye? Yeah. So apparently we're doing smoky. A black or a brown? Brown. Brown. So I'm going to start off with this dark brown here. I'm going to do my crease with it. I have trouble with my creases because I have loose skin there because when I was very young I had a kitten who was playing 
and I looked down from the couch to take a look at her and she jumped up and ripped a piece off my eyelid. So I'm not like, I don't have like a really droopy eyelid, but slightly droopy. Just kind of like going over just just tapping a little bit I just want to kind of not a wing but just a little bit more height at the end here now for the outside darker shade here I think I'm gonna go with, I have like more of this shimmery brown right here, which I might do right here. That's got a nice shimmer to it. Now with these, they're usually like, they're nicely pigmented, but obviously for the price, like this palette was like $10. So sometimes like you always have to make sure that you use a primer with this and actually I'm going to use a little bit of the darker stuff on top again because I do want it slightly dark but I still want a little bit of that sheen. But yeah like this is obviously a, the type of palette for the price that you know you will have to layer your coloring to get a nice look. You know what? I'm wearing like a lime green shirt. I should go with one of my greens for the lid. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I'm thinking how about this one here because it matches my shirt. We'll see. Actually, I think I like a little bit darker than this mixing. So I'm starting with like the lighter color and then I'm going with a little bit um, a little bit darker color here, right here. All right, so I'm just kind of blending a little bit of the edges here. This had the same color on the brown, so that's why I'm like okay with it. All right, so it's just like literally, it's just a simple like, most of it's brown and just with a little bit of green pop. Now, I'm gonna go with, I just bought this yesterday. It is Hard Candy's Stroke of Gorgeous Liquid Eyeliner. It has a felt tip applicator. I've not, I haven't tried this one yet, I'm excited. I always have trouble with this eye because 
this eye is the one I don't see as well on. <laughs> Looks good. The wings aren't too bad. For some reason, you can't see. I don't know, the camera, like, the camera catches it oddly. It actually looks much muddier than it actually is. But I'm still gonna try blending it out a little bit. And actually, I'm gonna do like a lid coat. The thing, too, with me is that I have really like high brows and I'm gonna go with I always have trouble picking out like a lid color because I don't want to go too light because with me I'm actually more of a medium I think I'm gonna go with this shade here There's so many nudes too, sometimes I forget which one I'm using. Now we're going to use the Color Seal Volume Express. This is a really old mascara, I need to replace it has like the curved you know color yeah I that's just oh my god what happened my nose started running I thought it was like snot oh my god that's a lot of blood but it was blood Pl plug your nose that's what I'm trying to do like Squeeze it. I'm gonna just put this up a little yeah, bit. Yeah, but like make sure you squeeze it for a little bit before letting it go. Just yeah. see if that'll staunch the flow. I'm gonna tamp on it my nose. We'll <laughs> we could probably find a way to do that. Alright. So that's my eyes. My kids. I have very yes, odd kids. Hormones. Huh? Oh yes, hormones. Thank god I didn't give birth I to I you. A cramp here. <laughs> Yeah, it's hard to be a girl. <laughs> Where was that? I was reading this too. Like, I just lost my place. Okay. Alright, so I'm gonna take, like, you know what? I'm gonna go with a black, with a angled brush. And just do my eyebrows. I don't put a lot. It's literally just to, like, shape them. <laughs> what? 911. Hey, I hate you, that guy, but I glued myself to the ceiling again. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So there. Alright, now I'm going to line my lips with Revlon Color Stay. Oh, fuck no. You don't want me to line my lips? <laughs> In red. Now, when I line, I always fill it. So much cocaine. Um. <laughs> the day you actually take cocaine is the day no. I kick your ass. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> you have every right to. None of my children do hard drugs. I may have cracked it. All right, now I have two options here because I bought two NYC lipsticks. Now we're arguing because he likes the traffic jam. Which is this color. While I like 
The Red Rapture. I'm injured. That's the one that I like on. <laughs> this. So apparently, because he has a bloody nose, I have to go with the color that he oh, says he likes. Yeah, so it's we're gonna friends. try it. I mean, oh. oh God, yeah. <laughs> Let's give it a try. I don't know, this is pretty bright. Yeah, maybe the dark red would look better. Yeah, and if not, I have my backup red, which works all the time. The F-bomb? No, F-bomb is actually pretty orange. Alright, let's give this one a try. I like this one better. Oh, yeah, actually. See, this is why you listen to Mama. But just for that look. Hmm? Pass me a tissue, s'il vous plaît. <laughs> Alright. So this is my finished look. With my new hair. This here, okay, this is so harsh <laughs> with the shaved head. I'm letting this grow back in about a week or so. It won't be nearly as, like, punk. So I'm just going to finish it with some Ben Nye Final Seal. And... Boo! And we're done. So, after this, we will be good to go, and I am off to watch The Kingsman. And, you okay? What are you doing? Um, so I can't use that nose spray anymore. My nose just started bleeding really bad, like all of a sudden. Obviously. My kids, everyone. Yeah. And then Jim, my best friend's husband's looking at me here. He's laughing too. <laughs> um, okay. Hey, so this is it. This is the final look. Thank you for getting ready with me. And um, again, like, Hello? subscribe. Oh, Add me on fine. my Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, um, Snapchat any of them okay, well, and uh, hopefully I will have other videos out Hello. and hopefully you guys like it Hello. um Love you. and yeah that's it bye, bye.